Okay, so this program will simulate a basic vending machine where you say the price of something you want to buy and what um, amount of bill you're going to pay for it and it will tell you uh, how much change you get back. So just to start, we need to import um, the scanner class. That's import java.util.scanner. Okay, and, and this allows for uh, user input, which we'll need later on. And we actually start here in main by creating a uh, an object with the scanner class. So that scanner in is new scanner and then system dot in. Okay, and then we need to create two constants: final int pennies per dollar is one hundred. Uh, 100 pennies in a dollar and then final oops final int pennies per quarter is 25 all right next we want to uh, prompt the user so I'll just write that here prompt user system dot out print enter bill value okay so this would be uh, like one two one five or ten you know dollar bill and that value will be stored in this variable int bill value is in dot next int so how um, next int works is it will just take the first number that the user inputs and store that value into this variable bill value Okay, so after that we'll do system dot out dot print again and just say enter item price and then in pennies. Okay, so we'll just do it in pennies just because that makes things a little bit easier. Uh, and then we'll create a new variable int item price equal is uh, in dot next int Okay, so after that we need to calculate the change. So let's do int change is uh, pennies per dollar times bill value, right? So 100 pennies in a dollar times the bill value, whether it's a $5 bill or $10 bill, minus the item price okay so that's how much change uh, that you will receive but it's it's in pennies at the moment so what we need to do is divide this uh, these pennies first into dollars and then into quarters so we'll start with dollars in dollars equals change divided by pennies Per dollar okay so how much change divided by 100 it's pretty straightforward and then you want to take the change variable and assign it to change mod pennies pennies per dollar so this modulus operator here this gives you the main the remainder of uh, change divided by pennies per dollar. So it's basically everything left over after you divide by 100. So that would be, you know, it could be 50 cents or 75 cents, just um, some number less than 100 in this case. So once you store the remainder into change, then we'll do a quarters variable. Int quarters equals change divided by pennies per quarter. Okay, and then we'll print change. Okay, we'll do system dot out print f. So it's a formatted uh, string we're going to print dollars, and we'll just do um, percent d here, and then the variable dollars of course. Then system dot out dot 
print ln just to give it some space and system dot out print f another formatted string this time it's the quarters so that will be percent d and this is just um, a formatted string so your variable is here quarters and yeah we'll save that and run it see how it goes and we need to enter a bill value here in the console I'll do a five dollar bill and how much does it cost mm, let's say we bought something for a dollar and fifty cents so you don't type in the dot just 150 um, great so uh, for a change we would get three dollars back and two quarters fifty cents and yeah that's exactly right so great there you go